Welcome back to HU16's Live at 5. I'm Jackson Duncan here with the weather. Right now we're looking at temperatures in the upper 60s, a pretty moderate temperature compared to the lower temperatures we've been seeing and the skies are clear. And looking at the winds, that wind going towards the south southeast at four miles an hour and humidity at a roughly lower percentage there, 48%. And now looking at the next 12 hours, you see the temperatures are moving from the mid 60s and with the clear skies to the mid 50s and some rainy skies. You might be seeing that rain right there and getting a little worried, but it's a lower percentage chance, probably 10% or less until 1, 2 a.m. Expect that percentage to be higher, maybe in the 40 to 50% range, but rain could be happening later tonight and the temperatures dropping from the 60s we are seeing right now to the lower 50s later in the night with the low for tonight being 48 degrees and that 50% chance of showers later in the night, probably around 1 or 2 a.m. So no showers for the rest of the night until later. So expect that to come later in the night and later in the week. But right now across the state of Arkansas, we're seeing pretty moderate temperatures. Again, temperatures in the upper 60s, lower 70s up in Fayetteville, 66 degrees, clear skies down in Texarkana, 71 degrees. Clear skies and moving into central Arkansas, Little Rock 67, clear skies, Jonesboro 66 and down in Monticello 68. No rain across the state as of now, but again, looking at the surface map, I'll explain why. We see the rain is covering the western part of our state, but not too bad and that could be only affecting certain times of the day, such as later tonight. But White County is not covered just based on this surface map. And I'd like you to look at this high pressure cooler system that's going to be making its way down towards our state. And here we see tomorrow's surface map that that is sweeping down and coming into the state of Arkansas. And that is going to be putting those rain and thunderstorm systems in our state and in our White County area. And on Wednesday, we're going to see even more of that. And in the upper part of the state in the northwest area around Fayetteville, there could be some severe thunderstorm threats. And again, Wednesday, we should be covered. And there's a 90% chance of rain on Wednesday. And the temperature should be dropping with that lower temperature, high pressure system coming our direction this week. And that leads us to the five day forecast where we'll take a look at tomorrow, 20% chance of rain, high of 59, low in the lower 40s, 41 degrees sun peaking out a little bit there. And also Wednesday, it will be trying to peak out there, 20% chance of showers that day and the highs in the 60s and low of 51, about as high as we'll be seeing the rest of the week because then when that system comes in on Wednesday, it's gonna be bringing that temperature down Thursday, high of 57, low of 31, 90% chance of showers. Temperature is gonna get below freezing. And then Friday, we got the highs in the mid 40s, low of 27. That is the low of the week there on Friday. So White County football, if you're gonna be watching that and going out to that, could be chilly temperatures, bring out the blankets. Harding Academy does not have a home game and Harding University on Saturday will not have a home game, but White County football Friday night, low temperatures for that. And then Saturday high in the lower 50s, and the low mid 30s, 35 degrees. So at the back end of the week, temperatures should be dropping. And at the front end of the week, expect some showers. But by the back end of the week, those showers should be going away.